Hey guys, Melissa here. Welcome back to my channel. It's been a couple weeks since I've done any type of tasting video. And so I went to my local candy store where they have some imported treats and I decided to try some Mexican candy. It was oddly super cheap and I asked the um, lady working there why and she said because nobody buys this stuff because most of it's gross. I think some of this stuff was 29 cents. I have no idea what any of this stuff is and I can't even read Spanish. So I've got eight candies here and I'm gonna try to fly through. The first one is a strawberry and hazelnut thing here. Oh, that's the back. That's the front. It comes with a little scooper called Devalin. It does smell like hazelnut uh, with a hint of chocolate. So I guess you just use this little scoop thing and try it. Both the flavors on there. Ooh. That was confusing. You know, the whole thing, it just kind of tastes the same. I mean, I would not just go out of my way to eat that ever. I, I just did, but never again. I've got the same thing, another one, except it's hazelnut and vanilla. Ugh, I give that last one bleh, on the scale of one to bleh. It smells a little bit better than the last one. The last one just kind of smelled a little chemically. That one's better. That one's actually pretty good. So I give that a pretty good on the scale of one to uh, deliciousness. Uh, next I've got this Lucas Mango. Can you see what's in there? Snap off this thing here. Ooh, that don't smell very good. It kind of smells like farts. <laughs> okay, apparently you just pour it in your mouth. Uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> no. Oh, what is that? <laughs> Can you please tell me what I just ate? It literally is a sweet and sour mango flavored powder. Oh, I got the littlest amount in my mouth and it I felt like it was moving. Oh, oh, I don't even think I can rate that. It gave me goosebumps, like, so goosebumps. That's what the rating for that one is. Lucky for me though, I bought another one of the same thing. This one is sweet and sour chamoy flavored powder. I don't know what a chamoy, 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 I don't know. Oh, the cap fell inside this time, so now I'm just gonna choke on that. Oh, oh, uh, oh. Uh. Oh. Oh, what is that? Is it like tomato? Oh, it's not going away. What is this? There's chili powder in it. I don't know what this is, but I don't ever want to eat it again. Um. Okay, let's read this. Oh, it just fell and flew across the room, so... Actually, I think this one might be decent-ish, so I'm gonna try this one. It's called the Jolly Rancher Crayon, and it's mango flavor, like that other nasty thing was. Oh! Ooh, what are you? Oh, weird. Okay, so you spin it. Oh, I don't think I'm gonna like this. There's like a thing, and then you... In it and the stuff comes out. Oh. Oh no. Oh, I don't want to do that. <laughs> Did you see that? Who made this? Oh, it's kind of sour. Oh, who made this thing? What is it doing to my face? I got goosebumps again. I think I'm, I'm starting to learn that mango gives me goosebumps. Oh, whoa, whoa, what is that happening? On a scale from one to confusing, it is very confused. It is confused thing. Next, I've got here some peanut candy marzipan style. And, uh, oh, oh, it's like dusty. Why did it crumble like that? It just like crumbled. Maybe it's bad. Like, okay. It tastes like powdered peanut butter with small chunks of peanuts in it. It's not terrible. So on a scale from one to 10, I'll give it a, a one. I've got another one of these weird shaped things here. Pelon Pelo Rico, tamarindo flavor. I don't know what a tamarindo is. Dude's got like stuff come out of his head. Naturally flavored tamarind soft candy. Oh, it's gonna be exactly like that last crayon thing. Oh, it is, ew, oh. 
Oh, no. Boom. Ah. Oh. oh, man, no. I don't even want to really eat that much, so I'm gonna use this little scoop thing from before. Why did I choose to do this? Oh my, what are you? Oh no! How is that candy? Oh, I've never had candy taste so bad! What's a tamarind? Why is it your candy? I'm gonna rate that, let's hope that was expired, because if it was not expired, that is nobody buys that come on if you're from mexico can you tell me what this is or if you've had this before because that was some next level nasty which brings us to our last mexican candy but it looks the nastiest out of all of them which is why i saved it for last salsa getty it does say that it is sabor sandia watermelon flavor salsa saboro Amarindo. Oh, it's this thing again. Does that mean that it is what with Lucas? Oh, it says with Didn't something I have say this Lucas? Oh, no, it's with this stuff Lucas Gasano. I didn't have the Gas Gasano <sighs> I'm just seeing now that the package looks like a watermelon so Apparently it's watermelon and puke flavored. Oh weird. There's something in... This is liquid enchilado. Enchil enchilado. Oh, great. Liquid enchilado sauce. For your candy, because everybody likes sauce on their freaking candy. Can I tell you that this looks like it is red noodles with pepper and salt on it? And it smells like that? Oh, it's brown. Who puts brown sauce on candy? Oh, it smells brown, too. Oh, just bloop some of that on there. Doesn't that look delicious, guys? Seriously? What is that? No, uh, nope. <coughs> oh, what is- oh! No! Who's eating this? Mexico, we have to talk. I'm just gonna try one of these noodles without that sauce. Uh-uh, uh-uh. No, everything is wrong. Oh, that's salty. That is salty. Oh my gosh. That just hit me. Those noodles are like salty. Sauce next to the cat hair on this plate. Oh. <coughs> oh. If you like this video, hit the like button. And if you've had any of this candy, can you please tell me what it is, why it tastes so bad, and what was it? Because, girl, no. While you're here, don't forget to subscribe. I make new videos every Monday and Thursday. For the month of December, though, my Thursday videos are specifically Christmas crafty related videos. And my Monday videos are whatever I want them to be. So make sure to subscribe so you see more of me, Melissa Strange. And until next time, stay strange. The girl told me at the store that Mexican candy was an acquired taste. Acquire me this. Nasty.